zip lining, swinging at the end of the world at Casa de Whoa. Arbol. Wow. Horses in the back. Banos is known as the gateway to the Amazon and is the last city still located in the mountain region before reaching the jungle in the Amazon River Basin. Banos is a popular tourist destination due to its natural env environment and more than 60 waterfalls. Kids are playing some chess. Locals and visitors alike undertake rafting, kayaking, canyoning, bridge jumping, hiking, biking, and horseback riding. Here we are doing, getting ready for some zip lining. Uh, Banos is around 6,000 feet or 1,800 meters in the foothills of a volcano. It's been characterized by frequent powerful ash explosions and lava flows that can be seen from Banos. One of the coolest places in Banos, Ecuador, is the Casa del Arbol. This treehouse is built on the edge of one of the mountains next to the Tungrahua volcano. The volcano has been active since 1999, and climbing has been prohibited since that time. Originally, there was one tree swing on the treehouse, but concerns about safety led to the remodeling of the treehouse. Now the entire structure is supported by steel beams instead of by the tree. The swing takes Whoa. you out over the edge of the mountain Whoa. for some amazing views. It can be a bit scary at first, but the seat belt on the swing helps you gain some confidence. There's also a zip line that is fun for kids or the young at heart. Here are also other swings you can go on. Plus, there's a small restaurant, Whoa. gardens, and restrooms. Don't miss this visit, as my kids loved it and didn't want to leave. We decided to check out the Eco Zoo San Martin in Banos, and it was a wonderful surprise. Very hilly up and down, but some awesome animals that were all around, and we had a great time with that. So, let you enjoy what we saw and see if you've seen some of these animals before, or if some of them look new to you.
After a long day at the zoo, we had to go get our almuerzo $2.50 lunch, which was pretty delicious, and a great view of the canyon. We love outdoors and outdoor spaces, so found a park here that had basketball courts, everything that the kids loved with artificial turf. It's called Parque Juan Montalvo. And just some more information about Baños de Agua Santa, which is Spanish for Bath of Holy Water. It's named after the hot springs located around the city, which have a reputation of having healing properties due to various minerals. Here's the kids doing some little bit of zip lining, which was a fantastic time. And while we were here, we also met the Hansons, who we meet later and hang out with in the World School meetup on the beach. So found a pickup game of soccer to play, which was awesome. And the Hansons and us hanging out. And then, of course, I had to show some food pictures just to see uh, you can have an idea of what's going on. With a different food scene, we love sushi that we had found. There's some kui. And this is where they're making some mora. Here they are grinding sugar canes to make natural sugar. There are lots of taffy making shops and the breakfasts were great. On New Year's Eve, Ecuadorians burn monogotes in the street as a way of casting out the old and welcoming in the new. Some churches we visited. We just had a great time in Banos. Mm -hmm.